Hello, welcome to a FIFA 14 player review for Inform Eto. I paid 450,000 coins for this player. Let's see if he lives up to the price tag. We'll have a look at some stats and then we'll go over to his, uh, some in game. We'll score some goals and uh, see what we think of the player. Okay, so he's 31, 5'11. He has a high attacking work rate and a medium defensive work rate. He's only got a three-star weak foot, but he's got four-star skill moves. Okay, let's go into some stats. He's got 86 ball control, 88 curve, 91 dribbling, 96 finishing, 81 free kick accuracy. Long shots are 84, penalties 96, and he's got 93 shot power there with 92 volleys. Okay, some mental attributes. He has got 85 aggression, that's quite high. He has got an 85 attack positioning and some physical attributes. He's got 92 acceleration, 92 agility, 87 jumping, 95 reactions, 93 sprint speed and only 64 strength. But that's not too bad. Okay, let's have a look at some in-game then. Some in-game, some goals, and see what we think of the player. Okay, let's go over now. Okay, inform Samuel Eto, an absolute tank, and massively, massively overpowered. Let me tell you, he is a deadly, deadly striker. He is lightning fast, and with the off, uh, tries to beat the offside trap trait. He's always on that last defender, and he wants to go. He, honestly, he wants to go. He, he's waiting for that through ball, that over-the-top through ball. And he just wants to get on the end of it. And when he does get on the end of it, it's goal. Nine times out of ten, the, the result is a goal. He is so good in and around the box. He's got great a great shot. He's got great finishing. He's got a nice finesse shot. And he's just a deadly, deadly striker. He's a really, really tricky player for defenders to handle. So you're going to score thousands of goals. Thousands of goals with him. He is so good. And I've got to say, he's probably one of my favourite uh, strikers that I've used so far. And that's saying a lot. Previously, I said it was Lewandowski and Aguero. But Inform Eto is definitely, without a shadow of a doubt, up there for me. He is just so fast. He's also got good jumping and heading accuracy. You know, it, it is so good. He's, I think his jumping's about 87. So he gets on the end of, gets on the end of pretty much everything you put through. He's really, really, really good. So overpowered. And for me, he's probably a, a, just a complete package. He can finish, he can header, he can run. His passing is all right as well. So he can set up other strikers, or if you, unless you've got him on his own. He can set up other people. He's just a very good, good player to use. Now, he's going to cost you 450,000 coins, which is a lot of coins. Um, he may come down a little bit, uh, but, you know... He's worth it. He's worth it. If you want someone in front of goal that is just going to absolutely destroy defences, <clears throat> then this is the player for you. He's got fantastic dribbling. He keeps the ball so close to his feet. It is so good. And his shot power is so good. It's like a bullet. He just he keeps hold of the ball all the time, just like that there. They tried to get the ball off him, and it's stuck to his foot like glue. He is that good. He has got a couple of um, negatives, his price being one of them, but then that, obviously that doesn't count for his gameplay just because he's expensive. So for, for a lot of people, that's going to be a negative because a lot of people can't afford him. But he has got a three-star weak foot. Although I scored a couple of goals with his weak foot, his weak foot was very weak. I wasn't a fan of his weak foot. Um, it was poor. It says three stars, but for me it felt like it was a little bit less. You know, maybe a two-star a two-star weak foot, um, but on his on his proper foot, on his strong foot, then he's deadly. He is just deadly. Bang! It just goes in every time. He is that good. He's got high aggression and decent strength. And his his, his aggression is really high, and his strength seems quite low. But I think his strength seems like a lot more. His strength seems a lot. He seems a lot stronger than what his uh, stats suggest. So please don't be put off by that. Samuel Eto in form is the real deal. He is the complete package. You, I don't think you're going to find a better striker than this player, um, than this in form card. If you thought his normal card was OP, then trust me, this in form card is even more OP. It is unbelievable. Okay, well that wraps it up. I do hope you like the review. Please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to me if you're finding me for the first time. Let me know in the comments who you'd like me to review next, please. Thank you very much. Have a lovely day. Speak to you again soon. Goodbye.